Tazamaji sababu leo tuko na jungu kuu peke yake ni kufahamisha kwamba jana usiku Manchester United ilicharazwa kichapo kikali cha mabao mawili kwa sufuri na Arsenal. Aliyekuwa kiungo wakati wa Gor Mahia na Harambe Stars Samuel Wino, Kempes ana imani kuwa yeye ndiye mwokozi wa mpira wa Kenya na hakuna mgombeaji mwingine anayekaribia sifa zake. Kempes ni mmoja wa gombeaji wa nane wa kiti cha urais wa shirikisho la Kandanda huku kura ikipigwa tarehe saba. Sasa ndiye anatupambia jungu kuu la spoti hii leo. Katika siku za ujana wake, Sami Wino alikuwa mchezaji mahiri. Kiungo huyo wakati alilelewa mtaa wa Ziwani Nairobi na kutokana na ujuzi wake wa soka, akabandikwa jina Kempes kutoka mchezaji hatari wa Argentina, Mario Kempes. Kempes alikuwa miongoni mwa vijana walionolewa kwenye Olympic Youth Centers. When I look back at my period, for example, the years that I was playing, I was part of a Olympic Youth Center which was uh, uh, you know a very top academy that was uh, uh, formed between in conjunction between the German government and the Kenya government and the head coach was uh, the head of the academy was Bernard Gall and they started this youth academy in various cities and towns and what that did is is we were able to be developed from a very early age in terms of our fundamentals And so when we when we got to the age where we were playing for the national team we became very good. And so if you look at the way the clubs performed and the national teams performed in this eastern central region we were very dominant. Miondo msingi wa kampeni ya Kempes ni vitu vitatu: ujumuishaji, uwajibikaji na uwazi kwenye kuendesha kandanda nchini. We have to have accountability, I mean uh, uh, infrastructure in the areas of youth football, coaching, refereeing, uh, you know, national teams Uh, in uh, in our scouting so we have to build structures in these areas and then every infrastructure we build has to start from the grassroots so uh, the three core things are leadership building of infrastructure starting from the grassroots and then you build everything on top of that katika ligi kuu ya taifa kempes ameahidi kuwa mamlaka yatapewa kampuni na sio fkf kuendesha ligi ili kuboresha mpira na kuvutia mashabiki na wadhamini we need to hire a, to build um, a league that is run by professional and but obviously as stakeholders meaning the clubs and the federation they need to be part of that either as board members but we need to have professionals run the league and that's not just premier league that's nsl and all the leagues below that alipokuwa na miaka 18 kempes alichezea timu ya taifa harambe stars na ana imani kuwa vijana wanapaswa kukuzwa vyema ili kupata matukio mazuri kwenye mashindano ya mataifa i have the, this plan where we start youth football from the primary schools we have to work with the minister of education of course but our youth football needs to start at the primary level to the through the secondary Uh, all the way to the national team so uh, my goal is to work to have two tiers of, of, of youth football one is uh, the, the first le level which is the primary school level where we work with schools and then we also have to give opportunities to anybody who's not associated with a school that wants to start uh, youth football kati ya wagombeaji wa nane kembe zinadai kuwa hakuna ambaye anakaribia kwa sifa na utenda kazi I think there's no candidate that comes close to me. You know, I can go through each individual candidate and compare my uh, my qualifications with theirs. I'm the only candidate who's owned uh, very two successful professional teams that created a professional teams that have a women's, a men's and a youth underneath that has facilities to to To, to, uh, for, with, that comes with that, I build a, a first-class facility for the club.